Hey guys, welcome back to Paper Mario. We're continuing the Crystal Palace today. Beautiful area. So we got the red key last time, so we need to make the Crystal Palace rise all the way back up. And it's probably taking the whole mountain with it. Isn't that just dandy? Oh, how nice. There's just an open area right there. I forget, does these, do these other rooms change? I know the outside doesn't, but... Okay, no. It makes sense that they don't, because only this part of the dungeon moves up and down. Who are you? The great and honorable Crystal King said that I can't let anyone pass! You're up to no good, I'm gonna have to hurt you! Well, you, I mean, you don't have to. We can talk this out. Oh no, oh no. Not the gray Magic Koopa. This is a gray Magic Koopa. He's one of the magicians in the Koopa clan. Max those gray robes aren't very flashy, but they're kinda cool. Max HP 11, attack power 3, defense power 0. He can use magic to make his companions transparent. We can't attack enemies that are transparent. Let's try to beat him before he, that becomes an issue. What do you say? Yep. Of course. Alright, well, I might as well take this opportunity to show off a move I haven't done yet. Let's use Cloud9. Chances of being attacked will decrease. Okay, so it just makes them uh, miss more frequently. Well, might as well focus! Ooh, that was a lot. I mean, I might as well use Care Carry. You can use Air Lift. You can carry an enemy away from battle. Fly around like crazy, attacking all enemies. Ooh, maybe not just aerial enemies. Do nothing, Paracarry. <laughs> that cloud is so adorable. No, I'm not changing. Actually, I probably should. To someone I know can do the job! Thank you, Cooper. Alright, so Cloud 9 is not terribly useful, because it only makes them miss occasionally. Oh, also that destroys the statue behind him for some reason. Boom, 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 boom. Oh boy, this will be fun. I kind of need some FP big time. Let's use the Coco Pop! I'm Coco for Coco Pops. Fire shell! The Magic Koopas look my robes! Wow, never seen that before. In this playthrough. Yow yow yow! Thank you, Cooper! Cooper is a gem. Hey, didn't you hear me? I said I'm not budging, you got that? Do you have any idea how mad the Crystal King will get if I let you pass here? I don't want him to be mad at me, so I have to teach you a lesson. I just realized I gave the Clubbas and the Hammer Bros the same voice. Oh, hey there, guys! I like quick battles. And I like all the money I'm getting despite having no, like, extra money badges around. 
I forget. Can you bomb this wall? Nope. Also, the bomb explosions make louder noises in the Crystal Palace for some reason. That's right, it's here. We can blow that up. We can fight some duple ghosts. Oh, hi. Let's use a shooting star, shall we? Oh boy. We're gonna want to take out the Bombette clone as soon as possible. That could do some serious damage. Well, Jeepers, we better use our some honey, uh, Maple Super. Jeepers Creepers. Jinky zoinks. <laughs> you go, Bombat. And in this chest we get the Triple Dip Badge. During battle, let's use free items during one turn. Overkill. Double Dip already is overkill, considering how good some of the items can be. Alright, so what you want to do here, if we hit that, you'll notice it turns around. So let's let Bombet go there. And we can get to the summer side. First strike against a white clubba. Yay. Less yay. Star Storm. I would ideally like to save my, uh, some my shooting star and my thunder rage for the boss. And I haven't used Dizzy Shell yet. Maybe I'll use that sometime. I haven't used Dizzy Shell, Airlift, Air Raid, Meg. Oh, I haven't used Mega Bomb. Mainly because there are very few circumstances where you'd want to use that over. Regular, uh, power bomb. Not a whole lot we can do here. Oh, there's an idea. Let's try doing that. <laughs> oh my! What's this? Mario, I'm the real Cooper, but of course you know that, don't you, old boy? Mario, look at me, I'm the real deal. Nobody else looks like Cooper. Mario, come on! I'm Cooper! I mean, this is ridiculous! I'm the real Cooper, sonny! You believe me, don't you? I'm the real Cooper. There isn't any doubt in your mind, is there, brother? Okay, old Bean, you best smash these imposters one by one. That's a good idea. Brother, smash them all except me, okay? <laughs> I don't know what crazy this is. <laughs> what? <laughs> you must choose the imposters. Uh, I'm just gonna do. Oh, okay. <laughs> Mario's crying. <laughs> so part of me wants to hit Cooper just to see his reaction. <laughs> part of me really wants to hit Cooper to see his reaction. But I've... Let's see. Uh, I can't really spare it. Get out of here, Cooper Coop. You must have some sort of sixth sense, Sonny. Grr, remember me, I'll return. <laughs> I love how hilarious this is. Ouch, that hurt. Still, good job. You must have incredibly keen eyes to spot me. Darn it. Hmm, Mario, well done. I don't know how you did it, but you found me out. Goodbye. Brother, I said I was the real Cooper so many times. So mean. Just joking. I definitely thought I had you going there, though. Yes, yes! Good call, Mario. I knew you'd get it right. Those were the worst disguises ever! 
Yep. Oh, that was classic, though. Let's go down here. Maple syrup. Cool. Actually, I think I will drink that right now. Maple syrup is for champions, you know. And hi there. Nope, nothing there. I love how crazy this gets, though. I've, I've probably said that eight times now. I'm sorry. Here's something interesting. You hit the reflection. And it makes bridges for both of us. How incredibly kind of them. Well, we'll need a key to progress, so... This area is just so trippy. It's awesome. Also, invisible block here. With a jam and jelly! You want that. Now we get another star piece. Sweet. Nope. Alright. We can actually move this one because it's small enough. Wah! Oh, hi! Ow. Oh, hey! You know what? I'm gonna show off Mega Bomb. This will probably be the only time in the game I'll get a chance to. <laughs> Ouch! Oh no. Extra one defense, I'm so scared, what will I do? I will use Fire Shell. It only takes 4 FP if you got Flower Saver on. <laughs> Thank you very much. You got the P-Up D-Down Badge! Increases attack power by one, defeat decreases defense power by one. I bet a lot of you figured there would be a badge like that. If only there was a P-Up D-Up Badge. That would be amazing. Now if we use the... It's locked, you can't open it. That's right. Because we pushed the little Bowser statue, or not Bowser, Rhino Dino statue down there, the big one also moved. There was a really, really, really strong guy who pushed it for us. Oh, fun! Our last FP. Fire shell's great. <laughs> oh yeah, if he if he uh, copies Cooper, you flip him over. Poor Cooper. Luckily, I've got some other FP restoring items, like lemon candy. Oh, I just realized. I hope I get a level up before the boss, but I don't think I will. And we get the palace key. The boss is actually pretty tough. Arguably harder than Huff and Puff. Because there's not really any... He can heal like Huff and Puff, but there's not really any secret to minimize the amount of healing he does. It's just kind of random. Palace key makes both the locks disappear. You can't go through here unless you solve the puzzle. Once you solve the puzzle, we'll let you through. So this is an interesting one. So here's kind of how it works. So there are these rhino dinos. If we talk to them, 
the turnaround and also the statues above us will turn around. And if we move the statues, they will also move. You can only move the statues in the way they're facing, though. I love all the cool puzzles they did with the whole reflection thing. Very well done. And that effect is so awesome. I love how they do crazy stuff, like, yeah, the world's made of paper, so we'll do that. That's one thing that Sticker Star actually did well, is all the crazy things they did with the paper world. Alright, time for the boss. Actually, we'll save beforehand. I doubt I'll lose to him. Oh, we should probably equip the right badges. Jumping stuff? No, thank you. Mega Quake? Nope. Mega Smash? Yes. Quick change is good. Do I want Flower Saver? I actually do not want Flower Saver. I think I will do Power Plus. Still have one more F... Uh, yeah, I guess I might as well do Jump Charge. Also, this area is so beautiful. Who comes to my palace? Finally arrived. <laughs> I know you believe you can save the star spirit, but I'm afraid I won't let you. First, I shall defeat you. Then I shall present Bowser with an iced Mario gift. He's basically the Ice King from Adventure Time, but like you know, he doesn't actually have a body. So or it's the Crystal King, but there are also these Crystal Bits we can tattle on. This is a crystal bit. Basically, crystal bits are just pieces of the crystal king. You can drop them with ease. Their max HP is 1, and they're only dangerous when the crystal king spews them out. Their defense power is 0. These guys are pretty weak. They'll keep coming, though, so until you've finally beaten the crystal king. So I'll show off what happens if you um, keep all of them alive. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. This is the Crystal King. He's one of Bowser's main guys. I don't know how he managed to take over this palace, but... Max HP 70, attack power 6, defense power 2. He'll attack you by summoning and launching crystal bits. The power of each attack is 4. The number of times he attacks is equal to the number of crystal bits he's deployed. He'll also try to freeze you whenever he can. When his HP gets low, he may try to divide and conquer. The power of this attack is 8. You can hurt him only by attacking his real body. If you don't know which one's the main body, you should attack all of them. Pretty brilliant, eh? Ooh, I just had a good idea. So normally I would use things like the Thunder Rage and the Shooting Star on him, but I actually just had a great idea. This is Paracarry's time to shine. We'll show off Air Raid. I can't remember actually doing this. Oh, look, it's another push to the left repeatedly. Ah, nice going, Paracarry. If you don't defend against that, that will freeze you. So defend against it. Man, Crystal Kane. You're putting up a pretty pathetic show. Whew. Oh, well, I'm out of Mega Smash. That's part of it. That's fine. That's one little thing he can do. And if he wants to do that, he can just do that like five turns in a row. Yep. But that makes 
him a, a more challenging battle, so I'm totally okay with that. We need more FP, so let's eat some lemon candy. Sorry, anti-guy. We're not saving that for you. Watt's the best partner for dealing damage because he's got two defense, and Watt pierces. Oh, boy. Now there are three of him. Now we will use the Thunder Rage. Oh, first one. Cool. If I wanted, I could paralyze him and then just easily kill him that way, but I, I want him to put up a fight. Then again, Mega Smash with all or nothing and a Power Plus equipped is pretty good. Yeah, I'm not gonna let you do that. Shooting star time. And I get money for it, so cool. Oh, again the first one. I will let Cooper get the finishing blow. He's been very helpful in this area. Last BP upgrade. After this, it'll go to 30 and it's maxed out. I can't up level it up anymore. Oh no, the last star spirit! King Bowser, forgive me! Uh, this music's not supposed to be playing? Why is this music still playing? What the heck? There, it stopped. <laughs> you have saved the final Star Spirit. And this is the last time you'll see this screen. End of chapter. Mario has saved the last Star Spirit, Kalmar, from the Crystal Palace at the edge of the world. Now, with the seven Star Spirits together, he has the power to challenge Bowser, and the Star Rod. At last, it is time for Mario's showdown with the evil King Bowser. Bowser's not that evil! Can Mario rescue Princess Peach and oh, recover the Star Rod, or will wishes forever go ungranted? We all know the answer to that. Last Peach segment, and we don't even get to control her. It's just all automated. Oh, Mario, I wonder what he's doing now. I wish I knew if I was helping him at all. Of course you are! Mario will be fine! You should be proud of your efforts! Mario knows all you've done! And don't you worry, Princess, you'll be able to talk to him in person before him all. Teehehehe, <laughs> I hope you're right, Twink. Thanks for cheering me up. Let's go back to the room, shall we? Oh, Princess Peach, your cuddly old Bowser's here! <laughs> Bowser does look quite cuddly. <laughs> Can't we have a friendly conversation for a change? Come on, let me see a smile! I have nothing to say to you. Aw, oh, don't be such a pill! You've stuck with me for a long, long time, beautiful. You better get used to it. Mario's coming, Bowser, and you can't stop him. <laughs> oh, you poor silly girl. I'm invincible with the Star Rod, didn't you know? Mario's no match for me. His history! Get over it! Your raunchiness! We have an emergency! Good! Better be important! I'm right in the middle of a friendly chat with the princess! Uh, Mario has now saved all the star spirits! There is a chance he could come here using their power! We must make ourselves ready in case he shows up! What the Mario?! Okay, listen, Kami Koopa, send everyone to their posts. We'll ambush him the second he enters my castle. Princess Peach, why don't you come with me to watch? You can have a front row seat to see Mario get crushed. You, yeah, you, tie her up immediately. If she gets out this time, heads will roll. No, please! 
You big Koopa, show some respect for the princess! What's this whining little quittering feet? Confetti? Gah, buzz off! Twink! Take a princess! Now, let's move! No! Goodbye, Twink. And then we get happy music for that. Okay. My name is Kalmar. Well, Mario, well done. Thank you for coming. You have successfully rescued all of us, Star Spirits. We are in your debt. Now all that is left is for you to challenge Bowser. My power should help you to bring back the Star Rod, to beat Bowser, and to bring peace back to the Mushroom Kingdom, and to save Princess Peach. Yeah! Super power! Mario's star energy goes up to 7! Mario can now use Up and Away, a new Star Spirit power. With Up and Away, you can turn all enemies into stars. That basically just instantly kills them all, but you don't get star points for that. Mario, you must make your way back to Shooting Star Summit. For shooting from Student Shooting Star Summit, we'll prepare the route to Star Haven. The name of this route is Star Way. Once you travel to Star Way, you'll finally reach Star Haven. My only wish is for you to save this precious world. You can do it, Mario. Goodbye for now. Bye bye for now. Ah, feels like we just entered the Shiver region, and now we have to leave it. Ah well. Ooh, also. Fall down here. Star piece! And now we're gonna take all the items. I used quite a few in the uh, Crystal Palace, so we should be able to take them all. Snowman doll probably won't even help all that much, but. <laughs> nor will the pebble, but. We're not coming back to Crystal Palace, so we might as well. This part of the song right here is just beautiful. I was trying to avoid enemies. Hey, you know what? I'll show off up, up, and away. Or up and away, I guess. I can't remember if this takes almost all your star power or hardly any. End of battle. It only takes two! Wow, sweet. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. I never even showed off the flower field guy's power. It's just a stopwatch. It's just, you can, it's basically like a lullaby. That guy licked me! Yeah. Up and away, for goodness sakes. No, this doesn't always work. It almost always does. But, there are, uh, there are like, maybe five times in all my times playing this where it's failed. On weaker enemies, it tends to work, like, 100% of the time, though. Alright, back to Shiver City. Let's avoid getting licked by the gulpets. They're rather irritating enemies. Whee! The fight with Crystal King was fun. I like that. Ooh! How many items do I have? I am gonna have to store some of those. Welcome to Shiver Shop. Let's actually sell them. Okay, I'm not selling the pebble. I want to keep that. I'll sell the snowman doll. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Alright, check my pebble. <laughs> it's a one-of-a-kind item, so you might as well. My ultra shroom. My jam and jelly. That should be enough. Now we're gonna take a nap. Because we need another iced potato. This toad slogan is refresh your body and soul. Mario! I took a nap, and when I woke up, there were all these items! And it was the weirdest thing. The floor was all wet, as if snow had melted everywhere. Do you think someone left these as a present for you, Mario? But who would do that? The snowman. That's who. And we get the ice potato, and we also get four mushrooms and an ultra shroom. Sweet! Literally. 
All right. Let's make some recipes! And also, well, actually, we should probably make some recipes before buying stuff from Rip Cheeto, since we don't have any room in our inventory. Actually, you know what? We only need one mushroom. Hey, dude. 64 coins, sure thing, we get a star piece. 64 coins, sure thing, we get a super shroom. Oh, that's lame. I love mushrooms! He has one more star piece for us, though. Another dried shroom. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, boy. But you're all looking forward to next episode, where I just do all the Chuck Gizmo quizzes. Oh, actually, yeah. There is something you can cook. Out of all these, iced potato... We get the potato salad! A side dish made by Tasty restores 10 HP. I did not mean to do that, Tasty. I am so sorry. Alright. Time to store some stuff. Actually, well, first off, we're going to eat the dried shrimp. And eat the mushroom. Oh, you know what I should do? I should show off little oinks. Welcome to Harry's shop. Let's claim some stuff. Fire flower. Iced potato. Oh, is that all? I mean, I guess we'll sell the super shroom. We don't need that. Thank you. We only have a couple recipes left. And I don't think the mistake actually counts as one of them. Alright, so... Jam and jelly. Okay, I already have the jelly shroom, never mind. Ultra shroom. Hehehehehe. <laughs> We get the Jelly Ultra! Dessert made by Tasty restores 50 HP and 50 FP. Best item in the game. Alright. Iced potato. Fire flower. Let's warm that potato up. Recipe's not too bad. We get the frozen fries! Side dish made by Tasty restores 15 FP. Wait, FP? HP. If I was in your door, actually, two recipes had a typo where it says restores HP, but it actually restores FP. That was annoying. That actually, I think, may have caused me a game over at one point. Claim items, alright. Maple syrup. I believe we only have two recipes left. And unfortunately, the other one requires another Ultra Shroom, which I don't have and I won't get till Bowser's Castle. Unless I use little oinks. Alright, Ultra Shroom. Maple syrup. <laughs> Cooper's just like, I'm so excited, I'm finally getting used! <laughs> Here you are, recipe's not too bad, we get the Maple Ultra, Dessert Maple Taste Tea restores 50 HP, 10 FP. Bet you can figure out what the last recipe we have to make is. I shouldn't have used the Ultra Shroom to make a Shroom, uh, steak. 
Aw, oh, buddy, I'm cleaned out. I've got nothing more to sell. You were one serious repeat customer, bud. I could practically retire now. The town was real nice, but I think I'll take a trip. Thanks, bud. You're the man. Oh, you're very welcome. Post office. Ah, Mario, you've received some mail, Bombet. Another one from Bruce. It's another love letter. Here you go. Bombet! I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, 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 I love you. I love you, 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 I love you. Please understand how I feel. I love you. You're Bruce. Yeesh, what a stalker. Watt has a recipe from her mother. Hey! Here you go. Watt, thank the stars that you're safe. I was so worried. When you first disappeared, you were completely ba- or we were completely baffled. No one could help us, and we couldn't find a clue. Then we went to Toad Town and heard about the toy box. I was pretty sure you'd be okay there for a while, but I was still worried. Please send my deepest thanks to those who saved you. Come home soon, your mother. Aww. Black of Lester has one from Flight. Who's this? Here you go. Dear Spike. You turncoat! You're hanging around with Mario! I'll never forgive you, you big traitor! I heard that your real name is Wacko Lester, too! I never heard of such a silly name! I'm gonna call you Wacko Lester from now on! The only way you could ever earn my respect from now on is to be Ward Bowser! Yeah, right! Do that and I'll forgive you! Flight of Team Wack has been Lord of Butt! <laughs> Don't listen to a word he says, Wacko Lester. You're as cool as they come. Alright, what was I gonna do now? Oh yeah, we go to Koopa Village to do Koopa Koot stuff. If he has anything left. Oh, I'm running over time! Why is it all the side quest videos run over time? Ah, no! Did not want that. Oh! Hey, and I should go to Koopa Village to deliver the last letter! And we still have a letter to Mayor Penguin, don't we? I didn't deliver that. Mayor Penguin, Merlo, and Goomba Pa. Darn it. Guess we're going back there next episode. Hey, Goomba Pa. Must be pretty gloomy around the castle, huh? I'm sure people there are depending on you, Mario. The only way to help them is to beat Bowser and save Princess Peach. Please hurry. Mr. Goomba Pa, Paracarry here. And after, like, five hours of spending, like, doing all this letter sack with stuff, we finally got it back. Thank you, sir. What would we do without postal service? Oh, how interesting. A letter for Goombaria. I guess I could open it. I remember she wrote a letter just the other day, and I was wondering what it was. I see. Guess it was a question. This seems like the answer. It looks pretty complicated, but I think I understand. I'll tell her all about it. Thanks so much for all the prompt delivery. Here, take this. We get the Lucky Day Badge! Sometimes it makes enemies fail to attack Mario. It's basically pretty lucky, but it works more often. But it takes like 7 BP, and, uh, like, forget that. It's not that much better than pretty lucky. Uh, no. We can worry about Chuck Gizmo later. You're a good soul for helping this old Koopa so many times. Now, Mario, I have one last favor to ask. That cad Bowser. You must defeat that evil King Bowser once and for all. The dear children of this village will never sleep in peace as long as Bowser rules. I wish for nothing more than peace and a reason for my fellow Koopas to hope again. Please help us, Mario. Aw, that's nice. Okay, hang on. I need more money for cheap Rip Cheeto. So, let's see what I can sell. Welcome to the old reliable Koopa shop. Ooh, that's oh, yeah, 150 for the Jelly Ultra. I'm not selling that. I actually might use that in Bowser's Castle. Jelly Super, man. That's tempting. That is tempting. I'll figure out if I'll do that next episode. Thanks for watching. I'm Color Farty. Next episode will be probably very boring. I will be most likely be doing all the Chuck Ismo stuff and then all of the letter deliveries. Anyways, have a great day and God bless.